Hello there, this is the Bookkeeper Master on YouTube. Welcome to another free QuickBooks training video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change the financial year on QuickBooks Online for a business, company, charity, or other entity. It's very straightforward, it's very simple. Just go to the gear cog icon at the top right of QuickBooks Online, and under your company, there should be an option for account and settings. It might not appear at the top left here, depending on the version of QuickBooks Online you have, it may appear somewhere else in this box. But click on this gear cog icon, find account and settings and click on that. In the left hand tab here, go to advanced. And then somewhere on this page, for me it's at the top, we have accounting. And in this box we can change the financial year. If your financial year for your business company, charity or other entity is 31st of December, then the first month of the financial year is going to be January. If the financial year is 31st of March, then obviously this is going to be April. So you put in the first month of the financial year for the entity, obviously click save and then click done at the bottom right. It's really important that this is set up because it will save you a lot of time and just streamline the, the reports on QuickBooks Online. By default, a lot of the reports will bring up a date based on the financial year. So the financial year is not set or if it's wrong, then every time you're running reports, you're going to have to fiddle with the dates. It just streamlines everything. By default, your financial year dates will come up on the reports and it just makes QuickBooks Online easier to use. So save, done, and there we go. Nice and easy.